Hello there. I'm Danny Lavan and I'm hot. I'm hot, I'm in smoke. I'm smoking. What is the season Hanukkah all about? It's about smoke. Uh, lights. Lights and eating latkes. Yes, that's so much smoke. I think the Greeks are back. Oh, Second night of Hanukkah already. <laughs> what do you know? Two candles, baby. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, a not that morning is going to make sun choke luck. Eat latkes. It's bad for you. I don't feel good. Hi, my name is Enad Admoni. I'm the chef and owner at Tahim, Balabusta, and Barbolonat. And today I will do a Jerusalem artichoke latke. For us, Hanukkah is all about frying everything. It's basically what America eat during the year we eat in eight days. So traditional latke is made out of potato and onion. It's served with applesauce. For this recipe, we're going to use Jerusalem artichoke, also called sunshok, that's the other name. And the flavor is between potato and artichoke. Really interesting flavor. It's I, one of my favorite vegetables. And we have some potato, just because it's a little bit more starchy and give a little bit more texture. This is different. I personally don't like the apple sauce. I think it's a little bit too sweet. So we're going to do like a little bit more tangy sauce, the preserved lemon with a little bit. There is a little bit Maya lemon juice inside, a beautiful yogurt, fire yogurt. So here, we're going to do now the food processor. If you don't have a food processor, you can just grate everything here. Now we're going to take all, you can see it's beautiful. You have the onion here, potato and the sunshok. We're going to put it all in the towel. And I'm going to go over the sink and just squeeze most of the water out. The reason I do that, I want as less flour as possible. And when you have a lot of water, obviously you need to put more and more flour. So here, we take all this beautiful mix inside. And now we're going to start putting the eggs. And a little rosemary can go a long way, so you don't want too much. Here, I think that will be more than enough. Obviously, time we can put much more salt. Okay, so we're gonna add one more egg and a little bit more salt. You know, potato absorbs a lot, a lot of salt. So every time you need to check. Okay, this is great. I'm adding a little bit mixed pepper here. And now this is one of the things you need to work really fast because if you let it sit first, the salt going to take all the juice out and it's going to be very mushy. Also, it's get darker and darker. So you can do them tiny little bowls. The best way when you do patties is first to do the bowl. And then when you have the bowl, you can just mash it a little. So now when we finish the mixture, we're going to move to frying the latke. So in order to see if the oil is hot, I'm just going to take a little bit, definitely hot, here. And slowly make them a little bit. I grew up in Israel, so this is kind of like a few different tradition and culture mix. We get like gallons of canola or vegetable oil and we fried some fennel cakes. We do a lot of sufganiyot, which is Israeli donuts. A lot of fried food in Hanukkah. Beautiful. We see this color. That's what you basically want to get. Here, I'm going to take this one. I like them very well done and crunchy. Beautiful. So here is a final result. Here I did some tear with the preserved lemon yogurt, a little bit Aleppo pepper, which is a little bit smoky, tiny spicy crushed pepper. And we're going to put just two. I think it's enough for one person. 
It's good. To get the recipe of the Jerusalem artichoke latke, please click the link below. Happy Hanukkah! One, two, three. You want the story about Hanukkah? No, I don't know. <laughs> Ah, <laughs> oh, that's it, baby. Hanukkah.